Uh, what's up, everybody? Good to be back with you again. We got the Indians and the Yankees. Both teams tied for first place in the um, American League. The Yanks at uh, 17 and 8, Cleveland at 15 and 6. And it's going to be Eddie Lopat here for the Yankees, who pitches to Ken Kellner, throws him a ball. There's a pop up into foul ground. Uh, out of play, 1 and 1 the count now. That's fouled away, 1 and 2. And there's a ball in there to him, 2 2 now the count on Kellner. That one's low, full count now on him, and does uh, a swing and a midge. And uh, Barra doesn't catch the ball, but uh, is able to throw Kellner out at first. One away, here's Larry Doby, and Larry Doby takes a strike. 0 1 the count on Larry. Breaking balls in tie, 1 1, hitting 287. That's uh, inside, 2 and 1 now the count. There's ball 3 to Doby. And uh, here comes the next pitch. There's a pop foul down to the right, out of play, full count now on Doby. Has swung on a missed, and Doby's retired, 2 away, and here is Lou Boudreau. Boudreau takes the ball outside, and then there's a little ground ball over to the left side past Brown Rizzuto there for it. Makes the play and throws the first for the out. We go to the bottom of the first. And here is Hank Bauer. Bauer up there hitting 313 with a little bit of power, and he takes a ball and another ball. 2-0 oh, the count now on Bauer. There's one wide to him. 3-0, and oh, and the pitch is in there. And uh, Keltner had that one and then lost it there around the fans um, at the uh, left side. That's fouled back. Full count now on Bauer, and that's fouled off. Full count remains. And uh, no, Bauer did not go. He holds up on that pitch, and that means it's ball four. And uh, so Bauer ends up being the runner on at first base here for Jerry Coleman. Coleman hitting 340 with a lot of power and a lot of times on base. And uh, that was a really poor move by that. We're going to send Bauer and uh, see if we can do some hit and run. Instead, there's a throw over to first. And uh, Vernon then throws over to second, and they got Bauer dead to rights, and so he's thrown out. One away, and here's Jerry Coleman, who takes a, a ball and then a strike. It wasn't even a pitch to him yet. There's a swing and a miss of that one, one and two, the count. That's what I get for being a little bit aggressive. Two and two now on Coleman. That's fouled away, still two and two. It's chopped off of his foot. Two and two, the count remains. There's a swing and a miss by Coleman, and that's a strikeout. Two away, and here's Tommy Henrik. Henrik fouls back a fastball, and one the count, hitting 304. That's off the plate. One and one the count. And that's low and away. One, two and one. Up high. Three and one now in Henrik. And he holds up on time and there. And that one and uh, draws the walk. That'll bring up Jim uh, Gene Woodling. That pitch is high. And that'll be a ball in Woodling. And that one is hit deep to right field and leaves the premises. It says I just missed the second deck. So you know where that was hit. That was hit right up here. And it is a 2 nothing game for the Yankees. And uh, here comes Cliff Mapes. So the uh, Bronx Bombers bombed them early. Mapes with the strike on him, fouls one back. Oh, and two now the count on Cliffs, and he swings and swing and misses, swings and misses of that one for strike three. We go to the top of the second. It's Joe Gordon. He gets a little ground ball over to Henrik at uh, first base. Old Reliable's got that one, takes it to the bag for the out. One away. Here's Mickey Vernon with now a two and no count on him. There's a little ground ball over to the left side. Rizzuto's got it, throws over to first for the out, two away, and here comes Neil Mitchell, who takes a strike. 0-1 oh, the count on Mitchell. 0-2 oh, is a fastball's in there for a strike, and there's a little ground ball over to Rizzuto again. He can't do it this time, though. Mitchell a little bit too fast for that, and there's a runner on it first. Here is Bob Kennedy, who takes the ball low. And uh, there's a strike to him. 1-1 one one now the count on Kennedy. And uh, there's a little pop-up. Coleman's got that one for the out. We go to the bottom of the second. It's uh, Yogi Bear up there who takes a strike. And then a ball, one and one the count. 256 for Bear so far this season with a bunch of power. Six home runs. Two and two now the count on Bear. He had a big one just the other day. You'll remember that one. And there's a ground ball over to uh, Bearden. Uh, has that one, stabs it, throws over to first for the out, one away. Phil Rizzuto hitting seventh, and uh, he gets a double to uh, lead that off. Why is Rizzuto hitting seventh? Because there's a lot of guys who are hitting very well on this team. That's the reason why. That'll bring up Bobby Brown with Rizzuto on at second. And uh, there's a ball high to Brown. One and no the count. A little ground ball over to the uh, hold on the right side. Gordon has that one, throws to first for the Averizuto. Moves up, though, two outs now, and here is Eddie Lopat, who fouls one back. 0-1 oh, the count. There's another foul ball just out of play. 0-2 oh, now the count on Lopat. That's driven down to right field, but it just hooks foul. 0-2, oh, and, and there's a strike three over the knees. We go to the top of the third. Mike Tresh up there takes a strike, swings and misses a 1-0-2 oh, the count. Hits one deep to right field. Bowers there for the out. One away, and here is Gene Bearden, Bearden who uh, takes the ball and then a strike. 1-1 one one the count now on Gene. There's another strike, and they're off speed. 1-2 and two now the count on him. That's hit the left field, and Woodling has that one for the out. Two away. Remember, left field, Yankee Stadium, that's a place that triples go to die. Ken Keltner takes a strike in the ball. 1-1 one and one the count. There's strike two middle in on him. Two and one and two. Foul back again. One and two. And uh, the next pitch in there is hit over to right field. And Bauer has a little bit of a problem with that one. It's going to be a single. And then uh, Kellner reaches second base on the air as Bauer had a hard time picking that one up. 
Here's Larry Doby now with the runner on at second, and he takes two straight balls, 2-0 no the count, 3-0 no now on Doby. There's a strike of the knees, 3-1. and one. That's foul straight back, full count now on Larry. There's a little high fly ball over to left field. Woodling is there for the out. We go to the bottom of the third, and it's Hank Bauer again. Bauer takes the ball, 1-0 oh now the count on Bauer. Hitting 3-13, 2-0 oh now. Good on-base percentage, and he hits one deep to left field, going, going, and that baby is gone right down the line for the home run where it's only 3-0-1. That makes it a 3-0 game, and here's Jerry Coleman who takes the ball in the dirt, 1-0 the count. That's lined up the middle for a base hit. So the Yankees are really, really taking it here to the Indians. Tommy Henrik up there now takes a strike, 0-2 oh, the count on him now. Count remains 0-2. Oh, and, and there's the ball, 1-2 and two now the count on him, Henrik. And he takes strike three, that uh, knuckler right in the zone for the uh, first out. Here is uh, Gene Woodling with the runner still on first base. We're not doing much with Coleman. There's a little ground ball over to third, and uh, Keltner uh, has that one over to Gordon for one, and then back to Vernon at first for the double play. We'll go to the uh, top of the fourth inning. It's Lou Boudreau up there. He takes a ball and then hits a uh, gets a base hit over to left field. Boudreau has been hitting the lights out. Here comes Joe Gordon, and uh, Gordon uh, fouls one back. Oh, and one the count now on Joel. There is a, a ground ball over to Coleman. Coleman makes the stop, flips over to Rizzuto, but everybody's safe, and that'll bring up Mickey Vernon. And these Indians can do it if they want to. It's only a 3 nothing ball game. 1-1 one the count now on Vernon. And uh, there is a, a bouncer right off the plate over to Bobby Brown at third base. He makes a great play on it and gets the out at first, but both runners move up. Dale Mitchell now with only one back. And uh, there's a liner through Henrik on the uh, right side for a base hit that scores at least one. And uh, let's see if uh, we can get Gordon to the plate, and we can't. And so two-run single for Mitchell, who winds up at second base at the end of that. This is a 3-2 to two ball game now. Ball one on Kennedy, and there's a little ground ball over to Lopat. The pitcher throws to first for the out, two away. And here is uh, Mike Tresh, and uh, that's high to him. One and one now the count on Mike. Swung on a miss, one and two now the count, and that's hit deep to right field. Bauer goes back on that one and is able to catch that one right uh, below the stands for the out. We go to the bottom of the fourth inning, three to two now Yankees, and here is Cliff Mapes who takes a strike and a ball, one and one the count. Mapes sitting fifth now, 300 on the season, and uh, that's a ground ball over that Keltner can't get, and he screened uh, Boudreau out of the way um, inadvertently, and Mapes is on with a base hit. Here comes Yogi Berra, and Mapes is going for second, and he gets the uh, base stolen, his third stolen base of the season. That was a good time to go. He had six in real life, three so far in this replay, so we've had some good luck with him, and Berra is hit by the next pitch from Bearden. He'll go over to first base. That'll bring up Phil Rizzuto, and uh, Scooter, uh, the question is here, do we swing away or do we bunt? I think we swing away with him. And uh, there's a knuckler inside. They're playing in on the corners. 2-0 and now the count of Phil. That's inside three, no, now the count on him, and we'll just let Bearden walk, and maybe three and one the count. And Rizzuto fouls that one off. Full count now on Phil. Phil with a good eye, of course, and uh, hits a fly ball over to center field. Uh, Doby's got that one for the out, and uh, we're not going to send Mapes. It would be a little bit foolhardy here to do that. Brings up uh, Bobby Brown, takes a strike in the outside corner, and a ball. One and one now the count on Brown. That's fouled away. It's one and two on him. There's a ground ball over to Boudreaux. Oh, he flips to Gordon for one onto Vernon at first for the double play. We go to the top of the fifth. I thought maybe about bunting with Brown, but figured it wasn't a great idea. Gene Bearden now takes the ball and then a strike. One and one the count here on Bearden, top of the fifth. Three, two Yankees. There's another strike to Gene. And he hits a uh, fly ball over to Bauer in right field, and uh, Hank's got it for the out one away. Ken Keltner now takes the ball. And uh, another ball high, 2-0 no the count, and 3-0 and oh now on Keltner, who gets on base a lot, and he gets his walk. And uh, that'll bring up Larry Doby here. Doby um, takes a ball, and then another ball, 2-0 and oh now the count on Doby. And uh, there's a strike to him. It's 2-1 and one now on Larry. And uh, that one's fouled back, 2-2 two and two the count on Larry Doby. That's just outside, full count now on Larry. There's a swing and a miss on the uh, fat, on the uh, screwball. My apologies. Two outs, and here is Lou Boudreau. Boudreau hitting 383. He's come down. He was hitting way over 400 for a little while. One and one the count now on Lou. There's a strike to him. It's uh, one and two. It's a little ground ball over to Rizzuto at short. He makes the play, throws to first for the out. We go to the bottom of the fifth. Eddie Lopat, the uh, pitcher leading off for the Yankees, takes two straight balls. Two and oh the count now on Lopat. There's ball three in there to him. Three and oh pitches there, and that's a strike. Three and one now the count, and that's low and outside. Bearden's given up three walks, has four strikeouts. Here's Hank Bauer. There's a ball in there to Bauer. One and zero oh the count. That one is high. Two and zero oh now on Hank. And that's way high. Three and zero oh on Bauer. Takes the strike. It's three and one, and that's way off the plate. So uh, Bearden's walked two in a row now for his fourth walk of the game. Here's Jerry Coleman. Coleman takes a pitch high, 
and uh, fouls one back. I tell you, you should uh, just take the pitch. There's a ball two on him, two and one the count on Coleman. There's a swing and a miss of the breaking ball, two and two now the count. That's way outside, full count now on Jerry. And he got him on that one for the fifth strikeout for Bearden. Uh, Gene doing a good job there and got uh, Jerry Coleman swinging one out. And uh, there's Tommy Hendrick who has a 1-1 one, one count on him, two and one now as that knuckler misses. There's a, another double play ground ball uh, to Boudreaux. Flips it to Gordon for one and on to Vernon for the next one. How many double plays have the Indians turned? They've turned three in this game already. It's only the top of the six. Joe Gordon will lead this off, and he takes the ball. 1-0 oh, the count now on Gordon. There's a ground ball over to third. Brown has it, throws to first for the out, one away. And now it's Mickey Vernon who takes a strike. And another strike, 0-2 oh, the count now on Mickey. And there's a ground ball over to Rizzuto. He has that one, throws to first for the out two away. Dale Mitchell now, and he f- does the uh, first ball, swings at that first ball and gets a base hit off of Lopat, and he's showing his teammates how to do it. That brings up Bob Kennedy. And here goes Mitchell, and he's got the base stolen, and Bear's bad throw goes into center field, which means Mitchell can go to third base. He's a potential tying run. 1-0 the count on Kennedy. 2-0 oh, is that one is high. Chases a fastball. It's 2-1, and one, and Lopat is falling apart. That's fouled off of the plate, two and two now, and there's a backdoor breaking ball that's just off the corner, full count now on Kennedy, and it's a ground ball over to Brown at third base. He makes a play and throws the first four of the out. We go to the bottom of the six, Gene Woodling up there. That pitch to Gene is high, one and no the count, and there's another ball outside, two and no the count. Fly ball over to right field. Kennedy goes to his left, and he's got that one for the out. One away. Here is Cliff Mapes. Mapes, uh, 307 out, one for two today. Oh, and two is the count on Cliff. And he hits one right through Gordon, through the right side in the hole for a base hit, and that'll bring up Yogi Berra again. Remember, last time, uh, Mape stole the base, and then Berra was hit by a pitch. And this time, Berra hits a ground ball to Gordon, who flips to Boudreaux for one, back to first for the double play. Four double plays in this game, and we're only in the top of the seventh. Mike Tresh up there now, and he takes a strike, and then a ball, one and one the count, and we're going to have a little bit of a delay here because... Um, the uh, computer has uh, decided to uh, give us a little delay. So here's the next pitch, and there's a ball to Tresh. Two and one, the count on him. Fastball's up and in. Three and one, now the count on Mike. Swing and a miss of that one. Full count now on Mike Tresh. It's foul back. Full count remains. A little pop up over to left field. Old Faithful's there for, for the out. One away. And here comes Jim Hegan. He takes a ball. One and one. Oh, the count. There's another ball in the middle. Um, uh, two and oh, two and one now on Hegan. It's over for a strike. It's two and two on him. Ground ball over to Brown at third base. He makes the play and throws to first for the out two away. Ken Keltner now takes the ball and uh, loops that one over Coleman's head for a base hit. And uh, that's his second hit of the day. And that'll bring a Blair Doby with two outs here in the top of the second, uh, top of the seventh. Apologies. Oh, and two the count now on Doby. And there's a called strike three. Lopat gets him. And we go to the bottom of the seventh. New pitcher in this game is going to be Frank Papish. We've seen him a number of times so far, and he pitches to Rizzuto. Phil takes a ball, and then another ball, 2-0 oh, the count. 3-0 and oh, as Pappas just missed that one. And there's the walk for Phil, and uh, that'll bring up Bobby Brown with a runner on at first base. And there's a, a ground ball over to Boudreau at uh, short, but this time Rizzuto was moving. No double play possible, and uh, the throw goes to first base. One away, and that'll bring up Eddie Lopat, and we're going to let him swing away. Oh, and one not the count on Eddie. And uh, swinging and missing that one is 0-2. And, and strike three is called on Lopat. He didn't stand a chance. Two away, and here's Hank Bauer. There's a ball in there to Bauer. 1-0 the count. 1-0 the count remains. And uh, there's a strike on him. 1-1 one one now the count. And there's a ground ball over to Keltner at third. He makes the play and throws to first for the out. We go to the top of the eighth, and it's Lou Boudreau. Boudreau up there takes a ball. Another ball inside, 2-0 and the count. And there's a swing and a drive to left field. Woodling is there for the play. One away. Here's Joe Gordon. Gordon takes a ball high and then is popped up by Lopat over to center field. Mapes has that one for the out two away, and here's Mickey Vernon. There's a ball high to Vernon, one and no the count, and that one is lined, and uh, Hank Bauer over in right field has that one for the out. We go to the bottom of the eighth inning, and it's Jerry Coleman up there, and there's a ground ball to third base. Kellner makes the play and throws Coleman out by a mile. One away, Tommy Henrik up there now takes the ball. And uh, fouls one away, one and one the count now, and Henrik, one and two is that one is popped up and fouled. Pitches under the hands of Hendrick, two and two the count. That one's inside as well, full count now on him, and he lays off of that one for the walk. That'll bring up Gene Woodling. Woodling fouls one back, oh, and one the count now on Gene. There's a ground ball over to third. Keltner to Gordon and on to Vernon for the double play. Number five turned today by Cleveland, and they still trail three to two. And we go to the top of the ninth inning. Here is Dale Mitchell. Mitchell takes a ball high, one and oh the count, and there's one foul back, one and one now the count on Dale. 
And uh, that's off the plate for a ball two and one now. And there's a ground ball outside of first and foul two and two. Two and two, the count remains on Mitchell, and he hits a little ground ball over to Henrik at first. Henrik will do it himself to the bag. One away. Here's Bobby Kennedy. Takes the strike and another strike. 0 oh, and 2 the count. The ground ball over to second base. Coleman goes over, grabs that one, throws over to Henrik for the second out. And here comes Mike Tresh, who takes a strike that snaps in there. And then a ball. 1 and 1 now the count on Mike. There's a curveball swung on a miss for a strike. Is 1 and 2 on Tresh. And that one's hit over to Henrik. Flips over to Lopat, covering the bag for the out, and that does it. So uh, the Yankees hold on to win this one 3-2, to two, despite being out hit and despite giving up two errors. Cleveland, as I told you, had five double plays. The Yankees didn't turn any. That's amazing. Five double plays in a game. Holy cow. Well, uh, that's the end of this one. Yankees are currently in possession of first place. We'll see how long this one lasts, though, because they have a whole series. And remember, it's only May. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.